Yeshua Hamashiach in the house. Uh, as you can see by the last video, I haven't showered yet since going to the gym. Nor do I care, nor do I think I will. Okay, I'm going to put this on backwards. I'm not going to touch it. I always fidget with hats <clears throat> when I'm on these for some reason. If I'm not, I don't. Uh, me papa was telling me all kinds of spell work and nonsense is still going on. I could feel it a little bit, so he just told me to jump on here. Um, there's really not a whole lot. There's one, <laughs> one thing I will say is people are thinking that they could send it like a, a fake Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby. Uh, I know who my Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby is. I don't, so how are you going to send in a fake one? I don't understand the logic there. I don't. Do you think that, that, <laughs> that you could find a better Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby than my Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby? Um, I can assure you that you can't. Um, I totally and completely and utterly adore my Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby. Yeah, that had fail. Um, I absolutely love and adore her. So you're not going to send in somebody else that uh, I would want. Um, all I want is my Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby. Um, and if I don't have my sweet divine soulmate, baby, I don't want anybody. So that's how that goes. Um, I she's the only thing I care to have. Um, so so good luck with all that bullshit. So I thought I would throw that out there. I thought I've made it very very clear that all I want is my sweet divine soulmate, baby. Um, I don't know if you guys thought that was just a general statement. I already told you I know who she is. She's a world champion knife thrower. Um, she's a legend. Um, you know, she might be at your county fair this summer, so take a look-see. Uh, complete and utter badass. <laughs> and I fucking love her. Um, I also love me Papa, me Yahweh, um, the Most High God. Um, I do get a lot of energy about the, uh, just kind of my, the, the disbelief that, uh, because I know a lot of people just through my energy, they know that I'm Yeshua HaMashiach, but they just can't believe it, even though they know it. Um, and then the fact that I swear and stuff, I think it trips people out. Um, it just makes me laugh that me Papa lets me and doesn't fucking care. Um, like I said, there'll be a point where, um, I will want to not swear just because, you know, there'll be little kitties and I'll, you know, I mean, I'll swear in my private life or whatever I would assume. Um, but as far as like when I'm publicly ripping people, um, it'll be a totally different beast because we won't be at war. But uh, I do feel that energy and it makes me laugh how people are just like, I, I don't know. <laughs> I think he fucking is Yeshua Hamashiach. Because why would he swear? And that's the thing. Why would I? If I was if I was faking to be Yeshua Hamashiach, first of all, um, why, why, if I was going to fake anything, why wouldn't I fake be, uh, I'm really Pat Tillman's brother. So if I wanted attention, why wouldn't I just go and tag, you know, piggyback my worthless family who I'm taking down. That's in bed with the Clintons. That's in bed with the United States government. That's in bed with the NFL. That's in bed with the music industry. That's in bed with Hollywood. Why on earth would I not just be licking the ass of all those fucking idiots? Um, because the reality is <laughs> I'm turning all that down, pushing all that away. And going to the most high and connecting to me papa because me papa put me in the Tillman family to take their asses down and not just take them down. They're fucking small potatoes. I'm here to take down the fucking Clintons, the Gateses, the world governments, the Putins, the fucking, the fucking, uh, what's his name? <laughs> the fucking Kim Jong-un. Um, I'm here to take down all these fucking fools. Um, and I'm, I'm just excited about it. And. It makes me laugh, though, for the few people that see these. I know the people that do see them are the most powerful people in the world. And by powerful, I mean have no power anymore um, and are going to go to hell very, very soon. But people that had power at one point, nonetheless. Um, and so <laughs> that's the thing. I may only have 30 views or 20 views, but they're 20 of the most powerful people in theory on the fucking planet. Um, and I know you guys have your ways. You guys run YouTube. Yet all the people that are doing these favors for YouTube... You're going straight to hell for no fucking reason um, because me papa sees it all. Uh, when you're shadow banning the divine collective, because I'm not the only one in the collective that has this happen to him. Um, there's a ton of us that have that happen to us. Um, and by a ton, I mean 144,000. Um, I don't know all 144,000. I only know a few. Um, and I haven't chatted with them or anything, but I do know that they're getting, uh, they're getting shadow banned by, you know, by YouTube and the fucking idiots 
that are part of, you know, the Freemasons and the Illuminati and, you know, the people that want, they think they're going to go up a notch when really they're just going to go down a notch in hell. Um, I don't know what part, I, that, but that's the thing. When you're brainwashed and you don't get it and me papa and, the, you know, works with the devil to fucking just fool you guys. Because I understand that, how perception is, uh, how me papa can mess with perception and how the devil can work with perception. Um, the devil didn't want me to tell you this. Um, but he works with me at this point. <laughs> He's actually helping me to fuck with you guys. Like, uh, like Mary Tillman, um, ex-mother, um, the devil, you, you sold my soul to the devil. What I guess he said, I was like 12, 21, 34, 18, maybe 16 too. I don't know. He said a bunch of different ages, all, you know, absurd that you sold my soul to the devil, how, how you did that um, when you don't own it. Um, on top of that, you can't, I'm divine being, uh, but the devil knew that. So he's just been having you dig yourself a hole you, for a very, very long time. So whatever you're seeing and hearing, sweetheart, uh, is not reality and uh, that's an unfortunate thing. So if you can repent, if you can hear me, <laughs> repent, repent, okay? If you can, if you can, somebody, if you guys know that this woman, my mom, um, and if you're, if you know her, you are doing the same shit. Repent, 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 repent. Um, yeah, get your shit together, guys. It'd be a good idea. But um, I know that's not the case. You can't hear me right now because you're busy doing spell work and. Uh, and you're probably looking at this going, what the fuck? It says nobody's watching, but I know that, you know, with Steve Rapetto's fat ass, and I say that with fact, um, with his access to Mark Zuckerberg um, and Steve Erickson with him being a big person at Google for a very long time, um, and just all the people that I know in the tech industry um, that all have access. You know, like uh, my brother Kevin worked at Lockheed for, for years and years after he was out of the military. Um, so he does all kinds of spooky bullshit. He was behind working on Zoom and um, he was fucking my ex-wife and you know, so he knows how to keep a secret. Um, yeah, he knows how to be unethical and immoral. Like I said, he works for the United States government or did. Um, and so, yeah. Oh, who's this motherfucker? <laughs> I swear, some of you are fucking, you guys, they think you're uh, subtle. It's just ridiculous. It's unbelievable. Um, but anyway, I hope, <laughs> I have people all over my neighborhood that are just, they, they're, it's fucking absurd. It's so ridiculous. Um, but whatever. Uh, <laughs> keep it coming. Keep it coming. Um, but yeah, my point was, uh, you know, everyone in my family that works in the military or, you know, has access to all this stuff and again, are you know, like I said, fucking babies drinking blood, sleeping with the Clintons, sleeping with the Gateses, sleeping with George Bush. I mean, these are all such filthy, disgusting people. Um, you know, between my ex-wife and Monica Miller, uh, so Christina Cusimano, Joe Cusimano, Yvonne Cusimano, these fucking incestual, disgusting pigs, along with Monica Miller, who just fucking, you know, just awful, just disgusting. And the people that they're sleeping with. I don't, I mean, maybe, I don't know, there's enough money in the world, I don't, no, yeah, no, no, me papa said no, <laughs> there's not enough money in the world for uh, for them to have been fucking the people that they were, uh, that's how just, you know, that's why that's, there's a certain point where me papa's like, to hell, nope, you're going to hell, nope, nope, <laughs> sorry, we can't, uh, you can't unpunch that ticket, you know what I mean, sometimes you just go too fucking far, you know, um, you know, sometimes you just drink too much. You're going to have to throw up. You can't, you can't go back. You can't undrink something. You can't unblow Bill Clinton or Donald Trump. You know, that's, uh, that's, there's no take backs on that one. Uh, <laughs> but I hope uh, you were able to get a nice little car, a purse or a sandwich or whatever. Pay your rent. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, my soul is worth, uh, I don't know, I, like I said, I'd rather be dead than, uh, my soul's coming with me, uh, always has, even before I knew I was me papa's son, uh, or me papa's daughter, but this fucking soul isn't for sale, and now that I know it's immortal, I'm ready to fucking rock and roll, you know, my, <laughs> I know you know what I mean, I mean, look at me, I look like I'm fucking ready to rock and roll, I'm Yeshua Habashiach with fucking, you know, I will say uh, the cross, I don't know why I, I kind of, this shirt, I was cool with me papa getting it, but the cross is kind of uh, what 
I died on is Jesus. So I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out if I how I feel about it. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't know how I feel about people walking around with little necklaces with me dead on them. I mean, I get the sacrifice part, but um, I don't know. And I'm fine with you guys having it. It's more I'm thinking about for me. Why would I want to represent a cross? I like this one because it's just a signature. But and I like the the ink here because the ink has the more to do with like the third eye and it represents you know Google ink and uh, it's the history of that. Um, but I resonate with that more than the one that I was killed on. So um, I mean, obviously, keep your crosses. This has nothing to do with you. This is me just thinking out loud about you know it, it'd be kind of like if you know uh, John F. Kennedy had a fucking assault rifle tattooed on his arm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like. Uh, I don't see him coming back and getting that tattoo. But that's why I got like, you know, the ink because it has, it's a totally different element. Um, and again, it has to do with the third eye and blah, 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 as you know, or if you don't know, now you know, I like to talk with my hands. Um, in fact, I love to talk with my hands, um, but I don't know sign language. I should probably learn that so that I can speak with my deaf brethren or mute brethren. You know what I mean? Um, I'll work on that. You know what I'm saying? Those, I mean, I know you know what that means, whether you do, you know, whether that's accurate or not, it's probably not accurate at all. Um, so I'll have to, I'll have to look into that. I'll have to look into that. But uh, yeah, just was uh, letting people know the spell work isn't working. I'm chilling, still hanging out, you know, beard's still growing, looking good. Hair needs to be cut still, but still fucking looking amazing. <laughs> Damn, is it looking amazing, Papa. Whew, see, and people would say, well, you're using his name in vain. No, I'm using it to say how fucking shit hot my hair looks. Right? See, he knows. Again, it's all about intention. It's all about uh, having a light heart, great heart, big heart, loving heart, caring heart, uh, not being a piece of shit. Uh, and uh, yeah, that's about, <laughs> I think we're good. I just, I wanted to just sort of take the wind out of the sails of the people that are doing spell work. Um, or blowing each other and doing whatever they're doing, drinking blood um, over the weekend, um, and just spending money and giving money to practitioners that have no, uh, they don't have the rank to fuck with me. Um, I'm pretty sure the only rank that could fuck with me is me papa. Uh, I know my ancestors can beat the living shit out of me and me archangels, so, um, but other than that, there's not a lot of people that can fuck with me, um, other than the people that love me, <laughs> which are me papa, me ancestors, me archangels. Um, and my sweet divine soulmate baby's ancestors because they're fucking legit um, too. I mean, naturally, they have a fucking world champion knife thrower in their bloodline. You know, you don't fucking, you don't just throw around world champion knife throwers into your bloodline. It's not an easy thing to do. So, uh, anyway, that's it. I think I did my job for now. Yeah, we'll probably be back. Um, I definitely need to, like, I was telling, sweet, remember Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby? I was saying I don't really smell. Um, I kind of just proved that. I disproved that. But it's also 108 degrees, and it took a while to get here. But uh, <laughs> I'm going to take care of it. I'm definitely going to take care of it. Um, so, anyways, I love you all. All the manis. Sweet Divine Soulmate Baby. All the fucking manis. World. All the manis. Thanks, a poop poop. Some of the many. Um, yeah, again, it's still love. It's still love. It's all love. Uh, but yeah, repent, repent, repent. Get your shit together. Uh, it's all about Yahweh all day, every day. Bye bye. Um, remember that. You know, just fucking remember that. Repent, repent, repent. Um, and that's it. That's it's written. It's fucking written. All right. Do your job. I did my job. You do your job. So me papa can do his job. And they're already doing their fucking job. And they're always killing it. So anyway, love you guys. I'm going to go take an empress bath. It's time. I'll talk to you. <laughs> All right. Peace.